That's not how you mince. I'm not mincing my carrots. I'm dicing them. What for? You're making stew, aren't you? The pieces are too big. I like to saute them with onions. It's how I do it. That's how you do it? Honey, it doesn't matter how you do it. It's just not how it's done. Would you like to help me, Ruth? You're more than welcome. Not at all, dear. You said you're making dinner tonight. You know, my Michael was the most handsome young man. He could have married any woman he wanted. And I always told him how important it was to find a woman who can cook. I can cook, Ruth. How are my two favorite girls? I don't think my guidance is appreciated in this house. Krista's a wonderful cook. She just has her own way of doing things. I'll say. Actually, Ruth was just giving me some wonderful advice on cooking, and I'm always open to learning. I think your sauce is going to be bland. Mom, please. Just like Krista prepare the meal, we have a big weekend ahead at Cooper's Canyon. Matthew, he's so excited. I am so looking forward to spending quality time with my son and my grandson. I'm adding spices to the sauce, so it won't be as bland. Why don't you go relax with Michael? I always wanted what was best for my son, and you resented me for that. And what exactly are you saying, Ruth? That I'm not good enough for your son? That's exactly what I'm saying. You are a self-centered career woman who doesn't even know how to make a proper sauce. My son deserves a woman who will put him first. Ruth? I love your son, and I've given you a beautiful grandson. What else do you want? Oh, for God's sakes, at least put some garlic in that sauce. I'm allergic to garlic. Allergic to garlic? Who the hell is allergic to garlic? You made that up. Look, I've got a lot going on right now. Can you just wait in the living room? No need to be so testy. I think I'll pass on dinner. I'm going to head to the market. I'll eat something there. Ruth, what are you doing up? I was about to start breakfast. Listen, I'm really sorry about last night. I just wasn't myself. No, that's... Let me make it up to you. I want to make breakfast for the family. Just relax. I'll take care of everything. Oh, that's very kind of you. Thank you. I guess I'll just go back up to bed then. Can I have your own shoes, Mom? <laughs> Let me get that for you. Breakfast looks good, Mom. It sure does. Thanks so much, Ruth. Don't wait for me. <laughs> Dig in. Oh, well, for sure. Mmm. Really good, Grandma. Honey, are you okay? <coughs> Mommy, what's wrong? Mom, please look after Matthew. I need to get Chris to emergency. Mommy, what's wrong with mommy? She'll be all right, dear. Come on, let's finish breakfast. Your mother's gonna be fine. Michael, where's Krista? We're supposed to be leaving for Cooper's Canyon soon. There's not gonna be any trip, Mom. What? No trip? Don't be ridiculous. Krista is still in the hospital. They're keeping her there to monitor for the next few days. What? The doctors. They said she could have died. I feel so terrible. Guess I can't blame you. No, it's the first I've heard of it. Will she be okay? I think so. Daddy, where's mom? Mom is very sick. She's gonna be in the hospital for a little while, but she'll be coming home very soon. 
Well, that should stop the three of us for going to Cooper's Canyon. mappy has been looking forward to it for so long. I'm not going without Mom. Michael, please talk some sense into your son. Mama, I think under the circumstances we should- I just wanted to spend some time with my son and my grandson. Well, I don't want to spend time with you, Grandma. Never again. What? Matthew, please don't say that to your grandma. I heard Mom say to Grandma that she was allergic to garlic last night. Oh, oh for, for God's sakes, at, at least, least put, put some, some garlic, garlic in, in that, that sauce. sauce. I'm, I'm allergic, allergic to, to garlic. garlic. Matthew, it's not right to tell lies. What are you saying? I saw Mom and Grandma arguing, and Mom said she was allergic to garlic. You did this on purpose. Mom? Look. I figured a little garlic would give her a stomach ache and that the three of us could have a nice time at Cooper's Canyon. You knew! You actually planned this! Oh, stop being so dramatic. That wife of yours has always tried to drive a wedge between us. Can you blame me for wanting to spend a little time with my family? You need to leave, Mom. Right now! You put Krista in danger. This is unforgivable. Get the hell out of my house. Shame on you. Hello? She's awake. Can we come see her right now? Great. Come on. Let's go visit your mom. Thanks for checking out our video. Hit that subscribe button for more videos every single week. And make sure to watch the next video here.